What is up, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the NXT TakeOver pre-show. And that's right, you are not seeing your uh, your pictures seen correctly. As you got the American Alpha, the Al American Alphas against Rhino. And that's right, that is James Storm making his NXT debut. That's right, you just never know what you're going to get in the pre-show for NXT TakeOver. We got another matchup after this, and then we will head over to the big show. The show people paid money to see. As right now, Chad Gable taking it to Rhino right now. Chad Gable, the Olympic, the former Olympic, uh, oh, the former Olympic man. The former guy from the Olympics. The former Olympi Olympian, uh, Chad Gable coming after Rhino right now. And James Storm is over there making his debut here on NXT. And we like to say the same. Well, Rhino's been on the WWE but, uh, right now on NXT right now. And Gable's telling Rhino, hey, you and I, we can do what we need to do here, baby. But we're going to dance. We're going to dance with the devil. As here we go. Going to bring him down. And Chad Gable makes the tag to uh, Jason Jordan. And this is exactly what they need to do. They need to make tags like this because this is the way you'll survive here. Especially at TakeOver Brooklyn, baby. Because, oh, baby, it's going to be such a great night with such a great matchup. With great matchups here and there. Fun matchups right here. And I can't wait to see what surprises are going to be in store. Because William Regal says, hey, we only showed you seven matches. But that doesn't mean that's all the surprises I've got. I got some surprises here and there. And look at Rhino brings Chad Gable back into this. The War Machine. Definitely not happy with the fact that, hey, these new guys are trying to make a name off of Rhino. And now Gable turns him around. And now look at Jason Jordan. Athletic ability at his finest with the American Alphas. And that's what you got to be worried about if you're Rhino. You know, you're, you're not the shape that you used to be. You, you use what you know for so much. But when these guys are just more fitter and more stronger, it's going to be scary because this thing like that, big boots like that have been Jason. Jason Jordan and Chad Gable know that, hey, don't let James Storm come in because he wants to make a name for himself here tonight. He wants to put himself on the map on NXT. He wants to do it here tonight. He might do it here. Well, he might not do it. And look at the power of all move right here by Chad Gable picking up Rhino, dropping him. And they know Rhino's the weaker of the two. Not to take anything away, not to belittle, not to do anything, not to say anything wrong about Rhino. Power bomb. Power bomb. And Chad Gable, uh-oh, uh-oh, Gable, Gable, take down. Take him, take him again. And Rhino's like, yeah, you shouldn't have been, you shouldn't have been taunting him, son. You shouldn't have been doing all that. All that taunting you were talking about, you shouldn't have done any of that. Rhino now picking him up here. Rhino, DDT, make the tag into James Storm. This is what the people want to see. The people want to see James Storm. The people want to see James Storm in. Here he goes. The Cowboy, the Outlaw, James Storm making the tag into Rhino. And James Storm was like, what is this guy thinking he's going to do? From the Barclay big Center, big here we go. James Storm telling Gable, okay, we're going to do this. We're going to dance around, and then I'm going to get you right here. And I'm not bringing it down right here. Storm not going to take this one easy right here. He's going to bring it. He's going to bring the fight over to Chad Gable. And Chad Gable thinking to himself, how do I beat this man? I don't know why I beat him. I don't know what I do. I don't know what I should do. Because I don't know I'm going to beat this guy. Strength. Just throwing him overboard right there. Because look at James Storm. James Storm's like, hey, I'm okay with this. I'm fine with this. He's like, this is my NXT debut. I'm ready to take you down. Come on, Chad Gable. Bulldog. And James Storm, the cowboy. Definitely loving this moment right now. Definitely taking it all in. Definitely bringing it to Chad Gable. The American Alphas are going to be in trouble. This is a, a moment you don't want to lose. You don't want to lose a matchup to these guys. These are, well, they know each other pretty well from past, from past, uh, I guess, past work with each other. But this isn't what you want. Oh, there it is. James Storm with a pin. James Storm trying to beat Chad Gable. And Gable kicks out. Abel, Willing, and Gable. Willing, Abel, and Gable. Gable's like, I'm Kurt Angle, baby. Close line. Close line. One more. We'll dodge that one. And that's two blocks by Chad Gable. James Storm in trouble now because Chad Gable's turning it around. Gable, close line. If it continues, it can eventually affect his 
vision. Yeah, already seeing stars. Not a lot of spring left in this game. Cable going high risk. Dame Storm, like, what? Oh, there it is. Chad Gable brings him down. Now the American Alphas might need to get this one together. Hey, why not? Why not get it together? Jawbreaker. Jawbreaker. Last call. Super kick, baby. That's it. That's the last call. Chad Gable. God, oh, there's a save by Jason Jordan. Jason Jordan saves his partner. Chad Gable. Good thing we're over here. And once again, we see a return to the specific maneuver. Hey. Chad Gable going to turn him around. This is an, an ankle lock. An ankle lock. Ankle lock. Ankle lock. Ankle lock. Ankle lock. Oh, James Storm trying to reach the ropes. He wasn't able to do it, but hey. Ankle lock hits and connects. That could be good right there. Suplex time, but no. James Storm says, I don't think so. How about a neck breaker, though? James Storm going to make the tag to Rhino. And now Rhino's like, I got something for you, Chad Gable. Open up. Open up, buddy. And he finally gets out of the ring. Oh, this will bring everybody to the And what is Rhino thinking here? What is Rhino? Look at Rhino. Oh! He's like, forget the goal. I'm going to hit you with that, Chad Gable. And Gable's in trouble. Gable might lose this one. And that's it. Rhino and Storm beat the American Alphas here at TakeOver. What? 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 Why? One in a million is the only way to describe this match. That match was incredible. Good thing it's a pre-show. Good thing nobody watches these. But the debut of James Storm and Rhino on NXT. Now this is going to make things a little bit more interesting, a little bit more crazy now. I think the moment to take out of this is James Storm making his NXT debut. That so last call super kick. And Rhino telling him, hey, we still got it. They might call us the old men. They might call us the vets. They might call us old. But you know what? We won this matchup, and that's all that matters. That's all that matters. Rhino and James Storm pick up the win here tonight. Props to these two men. Congratulations. We will keep going alongside here on NXT TakeOver pre-show as we get ready for the big show NXT TakeOver. But what a shocking win right here. James Storm and Rhino. Well, I guess it's not really a shocking win because it's their debut and they did it. But what a shocking debut. You weren't expecting this. That's why you don't want to tune away from this pre-show. You don't know what's next. All right. We are back on this pre-show. It's going to be blue pants. The tall blue pants and Payne and Royce here. This is a sizable size difference. I guess it's just the way it is. But NXT TakeOver pre-show. I'm not promising you the greatest wrestling in the world, but I do promise you a good time. Payne and Royce, though, really wants to put her name in that Divas discussion. A little upset, you know, I had a chance to speak to her. I told her, you know what's going on? He's like, hey, you know, I really haven't shown off that much, so I guess I understand why I wasn't put in that matchup. But, hey, I'm going to do my best tonight. I'm going to go out there. I'm going to be blue pants one-on-one. -on -one. Gonna meet her. I'm gonna beat her. Hopefully, it gets me more spotlight, especially since I'm on a pre-show. Hopefully, I get some spotlight on me, and hopefully, I'm able to do something with it. And uh, I'm gonna do my best to get myself in the contention for the championship. And look at Payton. Payton trying to walk away right here. Payton trying to beat Blue Pants, and Blue Pants almost lost that one right there. The gigantic Blue Pants. I'm just kidding. Another one, Peyton Royce, really trying to win it like this. Payton really trying to get the win like this, and she might just do it. I'll kick out again though. Blue Pants really needs to figure herself out right here. Because Peyton Royce has really come out tonight. And really come out looking for looking strong right here. Peyton coming in. She's she's fighting right now. This is exactly what you got to do if you're Peyton Royce. You got to fight like this. You got to give it all you got. Peyton Royce dropping suplexes right here. And that's how you do it. You drop suplexes like this as this takeover show. Pre-show. Could be over as soon as Peyton decides to end it. Peyton going high risk. Peyton, elbow to the heart of Blue Pants. Look at this kick, look at this kick, look at this kick. Kick to the side of the head. And that's beautiful. Rolling them over right here. 
Pinfall right here. This could beat Blue Pants. This could be the win. And this could defeat Blue Pants now. Blue Pants is not down yet. Kick to the back. Stop a mud hole right here, Paige. And stop a mud hole. What is this? What is this? A kick to the side of the head knocks down Payton. The competition in the Divas division right now is the hottest I've seen in a very long time. Face first. Payton has control right now. Payton smacking the head. Of, sorry, Payton's head being smacked around by uh, Blue Pants. There you go, Payton switches it around right here. Payton switches it around right here. Payton gets her with the belly to belly. Payton trying to regain her energy right here. Telling Blue Pants, I got to finish you off. I'm sorry, girl. But the game is played. I need my chance. I need to put myself on the, on the map. And that's how you're going to put yourself on the map. That's how you're going to do it. Peyton Royce trying to make quick work here on this pre-show. And that's it. Peyton Royce defeats Blue Pants. Let's see what happened during that incredible matchup. Look at this. This was a match that was simply mesmerizing. Oh, they threw everything they had at each other in this match. Payton Royce with the win. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching the NXT Takeover pre-show. I know it wasn't the greatest thing in the world, but no one said it was going to be terrible. As it was a good matchup here for Peyton Royce. Peyton Royce able to dominate her competition in blue pants. James Storm making his NXT debut. Rhino making his NXT debut. It's going to be crazy. At, I'm telling you, this is a little taste of what we're going to get. Not match quality but this is what we gonna get surprises we're gonna get crazy stuff it's gonna be a fun night hopefully you watch NXT TakeOver Brooklyn with us right here this channel right here thank you guys I'll see you on the I'll see you on the show this was a free show and it was free show we'll see you on that as Peyton Roy celebrates her win here at TakeOver and he gets she finally gets a chance to be on the spotlight and she wins her matchup Good, congratulations to her